Registered Phenomena Code 876 Object Class Neutralized Hazard Types Teleportation Hazard Containment Protocols The waters surrounding RPC-876 are to be monitored for intruders. In the event of infiltration, personnel are advised to detain the perpetrators discreetly as possible. Personnel must maintain at least a 5 meter distance from the shoreline of RPC-876. Should a relocation event occur, personnel are to withdraw to the 50 meter zone and await further instructions from command. Description. RPC-876 is the designation for a small volcanic island located in the Pacific Ocean. RPC-876's terrain primarily consists of igneous rock composites, with a notable absence of vegetation or wildlife. There are no discernible signs of human habitation present on RPC-876. In addition, RPC-876 appears to be entirely sterile, with microorganisms such as bacterial colonies being absent. Examination of the sediment present on RPC-876 revealed it to contain less than 0.001% organic material. On June 11, 2005, at 1.34 am Greenwich Mean Time, Authority monitors discovered a disturbance in the geographic location currently designated RPC-876. Upon further investigation, it was discovered that the space encompassing the island had been spontaneously warped approximately 3 cm north. A dispatch team was sent immediately to investigate the site. Upon arrival, the team discovered the mutilated bodies of three individuals. The corpses appeared to have been cleanly sliced along a plane, later found to coincide with the 5 meter perimeter of the island. Inspection of the corpses' attire revealed them to be operatives of the GOI Pythagorean Order. The individuals carried no personal identification, possessing only firearms and a small supply of water. Further investigation yielded no result, the team being unable to ascertain the reason for their presence on the island. For the duration of their presence within RPC-876, personnel experienced audio-sensory phenomena, including disembodied whispers, reported to intensify the closer to RPC-876 personnel were. The whispers were reported to be mostly incoherent, however, occasionally recognizable phonemes were distinguished, although in an unknown language. Attempts to determine the nature of the phenomena were unsuccessful, with no discernible source discovered. Containment was subsequently established, and the island was designated RPC-876. Addendum 1 On July 7, 2005 and July 8, 2005, at 12 am Greenwich Mean Time, RPC-876 warped 2 and 3.5 cm west, respectively. For the duration of the event, personnel reported hearing a sonorous wailing sound, similar to that of a crying infant. Addendum 2 On September 12, 2005, at 3.47 am Greenwich Mean Time, RPC-876 warped 1.7 cm south. Personnel once again reported the uncharacteristic sounds for the duration of the event. Addendum 3 On January 1, 2006, at 3 am Greenwich Mean Time, RPC-876 warped 5 cm east, the largest recorded warp. Personnel reported an absence of any strange sounds. Addendum 4 On February 27, 2006, at 4.08 pm Greenwich Mean Time, RPC-876 warped 1.03 cm north. In addition, RPC-876 began a process of slow rotation that continued indefinitely. Auditory phenomena increased in intensity, with personnel being unable to converse normally. Addendum 5 During RPC-499, RPC-876 warped to its original geographic location. Attempts to determine the connection between the two phenomena have been unsuccessful. Following RPC-499, there have been no further relocation events. In addition, the previously recorded auditory phenomena have ceased. Petition to change object class to neutralized approved.